So my my daughter and I were going to be nice to her this time, and we, I told I te my daughter is um. She is very nice. She she like gets along with everyone, and she's like, "Well, mom, you should uh, we should you should invite her to you know go out to eat with us at lunch because." Uh, one of the times a couple years ago, she we took her to eat at a this sushi place in town. It was kind of an expensive place, but my daughter liked going because she liked the the Japanese salad and she liked the bento box. So anyway, then this friend calls me or texts me a couple like it, like forty minutes before she wants to go and eat. And she's like, "Hey, you still is the are you still up for that? You know, paying for my lunch or or my supper?" And I said, first of all, it was for lunch because it's a lot cheaper than at supper." And she didn't care. She's like, "Well, I have until from five till six to you know do something." And by that point, it's like, "God, I feel like I'm being pressured into say, going. Like I have to now." And it's like, I was just trying to offer only because my, you know daughter was like well you know you should you know be the better person and you know she it's coming from a good place my daughter just wants me to you know uh I don't know but anyway I felt so used so instead of paying uh like six or seven dollars for a meal I ended up paying fourteen fifteen dollars for her to eat supper because I don't like eating supper at this place because the bento box for lunch is like uh six dollars six fifty maybe something like that versus the same meal at supper is um like fourteen fifteen sixteen dollars at night you know at supper time and I'm like <sighs> And, and it's just like, she didn't thank us for supper. She just left. And I, I didn't even, you know, I didn't hardly talk to her at all at the supper. I just, uh, sat across from my daughter and just ate my food. And I, I, I just, I was not happy that I was being pushed into the situation like that. And, you know, I'm all for being nice to people, but you shouldn't make people feel like they're pressured into having to do this. You know, you should at least have enough social awareness to know when you're making somebody else uncomfortable with how things are. Okay, I think I got this one fairly good now. Just need to pick it off the I got the the holes done. Um anyway, it just uh I'm nervous to go tonight. I really don't want to. Um, not even going to pay attention to the, the time on here because if the time goes beyond certain whatever, I'll just pause at some point and chop it into two videos. But anyway, I'm nervous. I don't want to go. First of all, you know, I don't want to go because it's a bar situation. And second, the reason why I don't want to go is this friend has no problem uh having other people pay for her and that's you know that that's that's just weaselly that's you know you don't you don't do that to people you know although my husband being a super nice guy he just he'd rather pay for you to go out with you know to hang out or go out to the bar so you can hang out rather than just have you sitting at home being bored or whatever. And it's like, okay. <laughs> but anyway, um, I'm, I, she has a, like when me and my husband were dating, she would, uh, come along with us on our dates or like if my husband and I wanted to go out to the bar as an, oh, sorry about that. Um, as part of my eye issues I get like when I blink then I get all these little crusty things in my eyes so then they hurt so I have to pick them out sorry about that that I was just picking out these little crusties but anyway <sighs> you don't need to know that <laughs> but anyway um so when we were dating she would uh hitch a ride you know come along with us and 
Next thing I know, my husband's paying for my drinks plus her drinks. And it's like, I thought this was my date. Or like if we went out to eat, she would come along on our date and go out to eat with us. And my husband is a super nice guy. He just like, you know, is like, eh, okay. Well, I guess now it's, you know, more of a friends hangout thing. But for me, it was more of, well, I wanted to, you know, have it just be a you and me kind of thing. And, you know, uh, but, you know, that's just the way she is. And it's kind of, it's always been that way. If she can weasel her way out of paying for something, she'll do it. You know, and it's like, you you don't do that to your friends. You you just, friends don't do that <laughs> to each other. And that's just, that would be like me saying, okay, well, since I'm here, you know, uh, let me go, let me go with you on your date, you know, and you pay for my dinner too, by the way. <laughs> oh, and you pay for me to you pay, you, uh, you drive me there too. So I don't have to worry about what